The Waste to Use Challenge was launched in June earlier this year with the aim to support three entrepreneurs working to reduce plastics, tires and organics and recycle them into valuable products. We received 19 applications and after interviewing the top six, we narrowed them down to three innovative entrepreneurs, the semi-finalists who are pitching their business ideas today. After shortlisting of the three finalists, they've undergone trainings on how to create their value proposition, how to develop their business model, they've undergone marketing, they've also learned how to tell stories and pitch their businesses to different audiences. And all of this is to ensure that they are able to penetrate the market and sell their products, as this will help them in growing their businesses. Africa is losing its forest daily due to the deforestation, mainly for charcoal and firewood production. Green Waste Initiative is a social enterprise with the vision to provide clean and affordable energy. The first step to realize our vision is by recycling agro and organic waste to form an alternative fuel for charcoal and firewood. Ecosay is a product line on the African Swag Collection that focuses on recycling um, air bubble wrap, which is mainly um, used to produce um, sustainable and fashionable products such as the Ecosay shower caps, Ecosay servicing apron, Ecosay raincoats, and also the Ecosay um, um, handbags. Since 1950 to date, more than 9.5 billion of plastic have been produced, and only 9% of this have been recycled. And the founder of the Plastic Recycling Gambia Limited, which was formed in December 2017, with the aim of collecting hard plastic waste and turning them into the grinds to sell to plastic manufacturing companies. So Waste Aid started the competition back in April, May, we launched the Waste to Use Challenge, inviting entrepreneurs, innovators, anybody working on the circular economy to, uh, to enter with their business idea. And we did this because we see there's lots of ideas, lots of innovators out there, but they lack two things, capacity and skills to make their, their idea a reality, and also finance, because access to finance is very challenging for entrepreneurs if they don't have a credit history and interest rates are very high. So investment in their idea would help them to scale up. Why are we doing this? We're trying to do this so we can fast track circular economy approaches in Banjo and in the Gambia more widely. So the real deal here is um, not who wins today but what your business can do, how can it impact the environment, the society that we live in, the economy, and this is most importantly the sustainability of the businesses. But here we are trying to see how can you look at this, what we call waste, as something that's going to be beneficial for all of us, like creating wealth from waste. So the winner of the Waste to Use Challenge is Aliyu Solway, Plastic Recycling Gambia. Winning this competition will gain a lot of motivation for me and my team, and also the prize money will help me to grow as a team and as a recycling company, because we were looking forward to expand to other regions in the Gambia, to buy more plastic waste or to collect more plastic waste to recycle into the grinds to sell to the um, company, plastic companies market. Thank you.